Hey guys, welcome to What's For My Candy Love, the special Easter episode. Um, also, it is the, uh, the one year anniversary where I started this game. Now, um, <laughs> I know I'm a little late. Um, it's mostly been from my exams. I recently had exams this week before school ended. Today was the last day and I decided to be a little rebel and skip school. Now, um, don't ever skip school. Seriously, it's bad to do it. But since today was my very last day of school, I decided to skip it and stay home and sleep all day long. <laughs> so right now you're getting a very, uh, a very uh, hyper Jesus, I guess. <laughs> so, um, in the last episode that was recorded was episode 11, the replay, I believe. No, it wasn't the replay. Episode 10 was the replay. So, it was episode 11. All my action points got taken up. Um, we teamed up with Light... No, not Lysander. We teamed up with Castiel. <laughs> Sorry, my mind's just still in sleep mode, kind of. But we teamed up with Castiel. We went on the field trip. Unfortunately, we did not win. We got lost. But we did get a very good illustration with Castiel. And it was of him basically trying to sleep on our lap, which was very nice. Um, and recently, I just found out on um, my dates that actually my level meter is at its highest with Castiel at the moment. <laughs> it's at 100. Um, right here. Let's see. You see? Right there. A hundred. I cannot believe it, actually. Hopefully it stays like that, um, for a while before, um, any future episodes because I believe you guys wrote in the comments and also messaged me that Castiel's ex-girlfriend comes back to the school and he is going to leave if we don't have a high enough level meter with him. So, yeah, um, definitely keeping that in mind. So I'm going to try to keep my level meter up with him. Um, but we are going to start this little Easter episode by putting on the mysterious ring from Easter 2012. I'm going to put it right there. It might not fully load or something like that. A mysterious ring that produces a pink light. It gives you access to the Easter 2012 episode. Once purchased, find the ring in your jewelry box and put it on. Alright, so we have it on. We're going to confirm that it is on. We're basically going to start the episode from here. Today, I have plans to meet up with Iris for a walk in the forest. We are supposed to meet up in the forest that is not too far away from the school. Oh, it's almost our meeting time. I'd better hurry if I don't want to be late. Iris is nice, but I'm not sure how patient she is. I took the bus to get here quickly, but Iris isn't here yet. I hope she will get here soon. I'm going to take a quick look around while waiting. As you can see, this is pretty much the, um, the area that we were at um, during the field trip. <laughs> And we've only got two little areas. Oh, I just saw something move over there. It's a little white rabbit. It's really cute. Come here, little bunny. I won't hurt you. Oh, no. Don't go. He is hiding behind a, behind a bush. You know what's funny is that I actually get a lot of rabbits that run around on my house. I got a little closer to the bush to see if the rabbit was still there. Little bunny, come on. Come on out. He had already left. Oh, Too bad. At the same time, what do you expect? Catching a wild rabbit is basically impossible. It would be much easier to eat some of these black berries on this bush. <laughs> what? I'll eat. I'll just eat one or two. They look delicious. Never trust food in the forest. I'm tired all of a sudden. After eating those black berries, I feel so tired, and Iris isn't here yet. I got closer to the bush to inspect berries, but they 
just look like regular berries. Maybe I just didn't get enough sleep last night. My eyes are closing all by themselves. Ah! But I see little rabbit eyes at the bottom of the bush. They're looking straight at me. I'm awake, and I'm definitely not in the same place. Where am I? Here's the big bush full of candy. I didn't know this type of plant existed. There's a tree with chocolate apples on it and a chocolate pond. The bushes are full of candy. There are sweets everywhere. It's like a little Charlie chocolate in the Charlie chocolate. Willy Wonka in the chocolate factory. <laughs> Charlie chocolate. Oh my gosh, where did I get that from? We're just going to go back and forth, I guess. This is where I woke up. If I follow the path, I'll end up near the big bush covered with candy. Where am I? Nothing looks normal here, and I have no idea how to get back home. There's someone over there. Excuse me, sir. Hello. H hello. Are those real rabbit ears or just an accessory? Look at your ears. They're weird. I was just about to say the same thing to you. Oh, now I understand. You come from the other side where we hand out our chocolates. Am I right? Where you hand out your chocolates? What are you talking about? Oh, you don't know? For Easter, we go and hand out our chocolates to all the children. Mine are the best. I'm the big producer, you know. There are many who have tried to learn my secret. You're a chocolate maker? That's right. My name is Charlie. Don't forget it. You'll hear it quite a bit around here. And who are you? My name's Shanae. I'm in high school. Pleased to meet you, Shanae. I'm guessing you would like me to send you back home, right? You must feel a little bit lost here. Oh, now? I would actually like to stay a bit. <laughs> it's all very intriguing, isn't it? I think that would be all right. You can even help me. Help you? With your chocolate? <laughs> Something like that. Before you got here, I was looking for my chickens. I need them to make my chocolate, and they have gone missing, or they've been stolen. I don't know yet. How many are there? Only two. I don't need any more than that. They lay a lot of eggs. Can you help me? Yes, of course. Thanks. I will look for them as well, but I think they're more likely to approach you. They don't know you, but they know what I want to put, but they know that I want to put them back in their cages. Okay, so there's one chicken. Tack. <laughs> His name is Tack. And there's the other. Great, I've caught Charlie's chickens. I was expecting them to look as strange as this place, but they look pretty normal. I wonder how they make chocolate eggs. So what are we supposed to do now? Hey Sinead, did you manage to catch them? Yes, you were right. They didn't try to run away from me. Good, they look hungry. Strange though, because they have lots to eat around here. Oh yeah? My chickens don't eat grains. I feed them chocolate, and I'm sure you've noticed there's a lot of chocolate around here. Yes, I have. Chickens eat chocolate? <laughs> I wonder if they're sick. Would you mind getting me some dark chocolate apples? They're the best, and you can find them on trees. There's one not far from here. Some dark chocolate. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think you, I didn't think you would say yes again. Um, 
pleasure is mine. It's very nice of you to come back quickly. Here's a tree with dark chocolate apples. Shoot, the lowest branches don't have any apples on them. I'm too short to reach the higher branches. I'll have to find something to lower the branches. And I'm guessing you're going to have to find this stick. Okay, so there's this, I don't know if I can highlight it. No, I can't. But there's a stick right here on this little corner right here where my mouse is circling. So you're going to click that stick and it's going to be put inside your inventory. And then you're going to go back and you're going to go get these lovely, delicious, dark chocolate apples, which I wish I could have had. <laughs> I used to, I used to stick to pull down one of the branches so I could reach it. Perfect. I got an apple. Now I just need to find Charlie. Oh my gosh, I love dark chocolate. I really want some right now. I found some. I hope they will like them. Super. Don't worry. They love chocolate. The only thing they love more than chocolate is grains that are normally used to feed chickens. But because I don't ever give them grains, there's no problem. I bent over to look at the chickens eating the chocolate. After all, it's not every day that you see that you see a thing like that. But they aren't even touching the chocolate. And after all the trouble I went through, it can't be. They wouldn't have. <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> Maybe they aren't hungry after all. But they're starving. Believe me, I've got an eye for these things. I just told you that the only thing they like better than chocolate is grains. And obviously, someone has given them some. So... You can just give them grains then. No, if I want them to lay chocolate eggs, then they can only eat chocolate. No grains, never, or they will just make eggs like regular chickens. So, what do we do? We're going to find who did this, and believe me, they aren't going to get away with it. Those two little pests are going to pay. Two little pests? You know who did it? My brothers. I'm sure it was them. You have brothers? Yes, two little brothers. They make chocolate as well. They've done this to prevent me from making my chocolate. I'm sure. I must go talk to them about this. Do you want me to come with you? If I go, I may have to do some illegal things. You, you want to kill them? No, I want to pull their ears. We're not allowed to pull on each other's ears because it is too painful. <laughs> Oh, okay. I was scared there for a minute. <laughs> Would you mind talking to them for me so that we can resolve this problem calmly? Sure, I'll go. Thanks. Let's go find these two little brothers. It is super hot inside my room right now. Oh my gosh. Hello, I'm Shanae. You must be Charlie's little brother. You aren't very talkative. <laughs> Do you know how to talk? You don't know how to think. If I don't talk, it's because I don't want to. <laughs> oh, he's mean. What do I care who you are? I don't want to know you. Look at the little peep on his head. He's a little rude child. He's evil. Cat got your tongue? No, I just don't want to talk anymore. Actually, you're funny. I'm Willie. Charlie is my brother. But to say he's big... He's bigger than you. Yeah, size-wise, but in terms of work, I'm the best. That's not what he says. Oh, that idiot is right behind you. Ch Charlie followed me? I turned around to look. Nobody was there. What are you talking about? What? He left. I just got fooled by a seven-year-old rabbit. Here you are. Why did you leave me like that? You don't need to look at me like that. D don't yell at me. Shoot. I made him cry. Ooh. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to yell. You're mean. No, I'm just awkward. Can I do something to make you feel better? Y yes. What do you want? Go see if I'm somewhere else. What? He got away. He is really a little pest. He pretended to cry so he could trick me. Next time you get you won't get away with that, Willie. <laughs> you vote of them. <clears throat> this time you won't get away that easy. It's fine. I was just kidding. It wasn't funny. I thought it was funny. You don't run very fast. Weird, because your legs are longer than mine. Whatever. You ran away when I was least expecting it. And with the head and with the head start you got, it's normal that I didn't catch you right away. We can try again if you want. No. I just want to know one thing. Was it you that fed greens to Charlie's chickens? No. Why would I do that? Because you are a real little brat. Charlie is paranoid. I didn't do anything. Okay, if it wasn't you, it must be your old it must be your other brother. <laughs> I'm going. If you want to race, it's now or never. I'm going to go. See you later. Or not. If you ate less chocolate, you could catch me, even with a head start. That has nothing to do with it, and I haven't eaten one piece of chocolate since I've been here. It's not what your hips are saying. Oh, you little... <laughs> the truth hurts. I'm going to be the one who ends up pulling his ears. Hey, Shanae. Uh, do we know each other? No, but Willie told me there was a weird girl running after him, and you're the only weird thing around here. You could have said the only girl. And who are you? I'm Wenka. I'm pretty sure they're trying to say it like Wonka. So I'm just going to say Wonka. The chocolate maker. Just like my brothers. Nice to meet you. I wanted to ask you. Was it you that gave grains to Charlie's chickens? Do you really think that if I did it, I would just tell you? If you're honest, yeah. Because someone who sabotages, the, who sabotages his brother is honest. He's annoying with me. <laughs> He's annoying me with this with his little smile. Well, I didn't do anything to my brother. Okay, thanks. Where's Charlie? I'm sick and tired of talking to his brothers. So, you met them? Yes, it's really too bad you had brothers. Haha, <laughs> there is something we can agree on. There are days where, when I dream of a world where my brothers don't exist. I'm not surprised. They didn't admit anything. I had hoped they would. Hope nothing. Willie even said he was the best chocolate maker around. Oh, he's lucky he went so quickly. <laughs> I'm not the only one he's made crazy. <laughs> there may be a way to make him speak and be sure they will tell you the truth. Oh yeah? Wonka and Willy like to play a game when they are together. One of them always tells the truth and the other always lies. Your brothers play strange games. This can help us. You just have to figure out who is telling the truth and who is lying, and then ask them the right questions. We might be able to figure this one out, but first, we will have to get them together. I'll take care of that. I don't know how, but it shouldn't be too complicated. They seem to be accomplices, though, those two. I'll think about it, too. If you don't find anything, come back, to this, come back and see me. Maybe I'll get a bright idea. Okay. Did you succeed? No, not yet. 
I'm still trying to figure out a way to get them together too. Good luck. We can do it. I hope. Shoot, he's alone. Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> oh, nothing. I'm going to wait just a bit. I'm going to wait a bit just in case they find each other without me. That's the same face I make when I'm preparing a prank. What are you up to? The same face as him? That would be horrible. Wonka is with him. Too bad. Wow. What? You were deep in your thoughts. It surprised me. So what? I didn't know you were capable of thinking. It's surprising. I'm going to get you. <laughs> Shoot. He's still alone. I have to get them together myself. If you had been nice, I would think otherwise. But to see you looking at me like that makes me uncomfortable. Do you want to come with me? Not in this lifetime. <laughs> at least he's clear. I might have more luck with Willie. That is a solid argument. Please, I just want to talk to you and Willie. You didn't talk to Charlie by any chance, did you? No, not at all. Okay, I'll have to find another idea. You don't want to come with me? If you can catch me, maybe. I'm not going to chase after you if you don't stand a chance to win anything. So, give up. I wouldn't have followed you anyways. Shoot, neither of them want to follow me. I'll have to find another way to get them together. Ah, there, here you are. I thought of something. Good, because I've had it up to here. <laughs> I have to deal with them all year round. Poor thing. <laughs> so, here's the plan. I've kept our favorite treat aside for a special occasion. We can still, we can tell them that this is one. Your favorite treat? A carrot. An enormous, uh, 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 <laughs> an enormous carrot. I'll give it to you, and you tell them that they won't get any if they don't follow you. That sounds like a good idea. I hope it works. Willie and Wonka are pretty greedy, believe me. They'll fall into the trap, no problem. What are you hiding behind your back? This! I showed him the carrot. Is it for me? Only if you follow me. You're mean. You show me a carrot and make me believe it's a gift and finally I have to do something to get it? You should be ashamed. Stop pretending to cry. You won't fool me a second time. There is still a problem. But yeah, what's the problem? I want that carrot and I don't feel like following you. Do you see the now? It's up to you to choose, but it would be a shame to not enjoy this carrot, don't you think? Oh, I completely agree, and that's why I'm going to take the carrot and leave. I don't think you understood the conditions very well. Haha, <laughs> he jumped on my arm and ripped the carrot from my hands and left running. Really, you little, this time he has gone too far. Oh, Wonka is here too. They're eating the carrot. Oh, it's you. Thanks. If I had known that annoying you would cause you to give us this carrot, I would have been a lot worse. Don't be mistaken. It's not a gift. I just wanted to get you both together. Get us together? Why? Well, uh, your game, you know. Oh, yeah. Nothing good can come from that smile. Do you want to play Who's Liar? Okay, it should be fun. But there are certain rules you have to follow, just so it's not too easy for you. Okay. One of us is telling the truth, and the other is lying. If you lose, you have to eat one of my chocolate eggs. They aren't poisoned, if that assures you. Okay, great. Again. <laughs> so, you have to find out who is telling the truth and who is lying. It seems easy so far. And because you want to find out who played a trick on Charlie, you must also find out who stole the chickens and who fed them grains for you who lose. Okay, so I have to find out who's lying, 
who stole the chickens and who fed them grains? All this and you can only ask three questions. Okay, only three? That's not bad. We could have given you one, but since you gave us that carrot, we'll be a bit nice. Gabe? More like you helped yourself. Another thing, you can also ask each question to one of us, the three times you must choose who to ask. That's a lot of conditions. The game is never fun without a few rules. Certainly, but still. Alright, are you ready? Yes, in any case, if I lose, I'll just have to eat a chocolate egg. It's not the end of the world. Okay, let's go. Don't forget. One of us is always telling the truth, and the other is always lying. Hmm. It's a sky blue. What do I want to ask? Let's ask Wonka. Yes, the sky is blue. If he was a liar, he would have said no. Um. Who stole the chickens? Let's ask Willie. Me. Now that I know who's lying, I can figure out who did it. And looking at his face, I think I'm on the right track. Okay. Um, who gave the grains to the chicken? Let's ask. Wonka, Willie, as I know who's lying, I know who did it. Super, I have figured out who did what and who was the last. It's the verdict. Who stole the chickens? I'm going to say the person who stole the chickens was um, Wonka. Exactly. Yes, super. <laughs> um... Don't get too excited. Who fed them the grains? Really? Correct as well. Alright. I'll just have to tell them who's the liar. Who's the liar? Ugh, you were lucky, that's all. You were right. It was fun. Speak for yourself. Go on. Go tell Charlie here, Tattletail. You shouldn't have done those bad things. Good, I can go back to see Charlie and explain everything. He'll be happy, I'm sure. Now, where's Charlie? So, did you figure out who did what? Yes, in the end, one of them stole the chickens and the other fed them the grains. Ah, both of them were in on it. Sorry. I should have made you eat my chocolate, little tattletale. What is in this chocolate you to make me want to eat it so badly? And you dare to come to me after what you've done, really? Wait until I get a hold of you. I know someone who's going to get his Arabs pulled. <laughs> Willie ran away and Charlie ran after him. I tried to catch up to them to see what was going on. Ah, oh, they are over there. Wonka is with them, too. Okay. <laughs> uh... I might wait a bit before settling in. Ah, Shanae, we were looking for you. We? Your brothers too? Yes, we've come to an arrangement. Uh, they have helped me re uh, repair the damages and I'll let them live. Haha. <laughs> in the end, I wonder which of the brothers is the worst. They don't seem thrilled about that. To thank you for solving this family feud, we'd want to offer you something. Oh yeah? It's great. See illustration. <laughs> I'm so upset. He's so mad and he's so embarrassed. And he's so happy. I like that big chocolate egg though. <laughs> it looks so cute. We? I didn't want to give her anything. You are the one who said... <laughs> Ouch! Charlie hit him on the head. We'll start with mine. One of the best chocolate eggs. Thanks! It is beautiful. I don't want to eat it. I'll put it on display in my room. Here are my old 
clothes. They won't look as good on you, but I have to give you something. Thanks. Aww. Hold on. I'm going to change this. And me. Here's the little chick and the chocolate I wanted to give you earlier. He gave me the chocolate egg and the chick and set them in my hands. Can I eat it? No risk. Yes, taste it now. I took a bite of the chocolate egg. Everything around me is getting blurry. My eyes are closing all by themselves. Bye bye, Shanae. Everything got black and I fell asleep. And thanks for everything. When I woke up, I was back in the forest under the blackberry bush. Holy cow, Shanae, you scared me. Oh, Iris! What are you doing on the ground? Are you not feeling well? We can go home if you want. No, it's okay. I'm feeling better. It must have been a dream. You're dressed weird, but it's cute. Especially the hood with the donkey ears. <laughs> the bunny ears, Iris. All day, I felt like we were being followed by a white rabbit and a, and a gray rabbit hiding in the bushes. Congrats, you finished the special Easter episode. Finish episode. You finished your single episode. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so that's pretty much it for this episode. Um, write down in the comments below because um, I was thinking um, maybe I should do this as for, you know, the one year anniversary thing. Um, I haven't gotten all of my, um, setup yet for, um, starting my new LPs. My new Let's Plays with, like, the other games that I want to do. Um, but I have, like, I don't even know how many boxes. I have, like, maybe three boxes of Peeps. Um, the little squishy marshmallows, um, the colored ones that have, like, the different animals, like the bunny or the, um, little chick. So, I have those. Um, write down in the comments below if you'd like to see a video of me doing Chubby Bunny with Peeps. I'll probably have one of my cousins, um, play along with me, um, play Chubby Bunny with me. But, you know, I actually kind of really want to do this. And, yeah. Either way, if you guys say no, I'll most likely probably do it anyways. But just write down in the comments below if you want to see that. Um, and, yeah. Um, so, school's officially over for me. I'm on summer vacation now. But I will be doing a lot of traveling. So, I'm not sure how my schedule will be this exact um, month. Because I only have um, summer vacation for a month. Um, but, yeah, um, comment, like, subscribe, you know, do whatever you want. Um, and thank you for watching. And last but never the least. Bye!